By now, research is telling us that uh, the informal economy works very much uh, on the basis of collaboration, networking, uh, sharing knowledge. These are very much the principles that are at the core uh, of the maker movement. That's probably one of the most important things for us is having a space where other like-minded people get together because that's really where true innovation happens. Just to be in that environment you know, where ideas are shared every day, where you collaborate on so many things, you know, we find it to be quite helpful. There's a lot of collaboration and a lot of uh, openness about the things that they do. So it makes it easier uh, to relate, easier to also learn, and easier to share experiences. I actually want women around the continent to come and collaborate, to come and learn from each other and see how and exchange knowledge, see how we can actually grow together as, as, as women in the same field. I think what that space does, it allows me to have access to other people who have, who have similar ideas as myself and we have, we have the similar type of um, abilities and attitude. I think that's very important for creative people to be exposed to other like-minded individuals. The spirit of openness and collaboration shows us that openness is essential to innovation in these environments and that runs contrary to conventional thinking that uh, exclusivity and proprietary control over knowledge and ideas is necessary to drive innovation and in the maker movement we see the exact opposite thing happen. There's a whole lot of people who are in there you know people with different skills and just being in that environment somehow you know or we get to share ideas we are collaborating quite a lot so it's, it's a really good space.